And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Garen Draven. Got another donation deck here. This is from a viewer that's been playing this one over in Ranked and been having some success, saying it's been going pretty well. And it it's a pretty interesting looking deck. These, these aren't necessarily uh, cards you see all the time, but a lot of underrated cards in here. And I could see this working out just fine. We get to do a lot of uh, neat stuff during combat. We have a lot of challengers including uh, Laurent Chevalier that can create even more challengers in hand. And we have different ways to protect those challengers. Sorry about that. With some stuff like Repost and back-to-back um, -back, uh, and, you know, some things like that. But then also we have a lot of support. Legion Drummer is a big part of our deck, supporting our challengers, giving them quick attacks so they can just eat the opponent's uh, units without... Um, you know, taking any damage on the way back. That's going to be a big part of our deck. That's why it's a three of. It's even more than Warships because we really want that quick attack. Draven should be pretty sweet here. Also, um, you know, another good quick attack thing that's hard to deal with in combat. We got a couple of Whirling Deaths that will allow us to do some more things in combat. And even Might. Might's a card that, you know, you you think like this isn't a removal spell, but if we're using it on Challengers, or if we're using it, you know, we're using it on like Challengers with a quick attack, we can pump them up and make sure they can even challenge some larger units. We also have Blade Keeper that can pump up our units, make them larger. And then our top end card, we got Garen. Garen's an underrated card. This is a great card in Expeditions. For those of y'all playing a bunch of Expeditions, earning those cards for your account. If you're doing that, uh, definitely draft Garen. It's a good one. Um, but yeah, we want Garen to strike twice to level up. And that's what our deck's uh, focused on, is striking twice. We have Concerted Strike single combat those help it strike and then of course the whirling deaths so those are all extra ways that we can get our garen to strike get to level up get more attacks because our deck's good at attacking so we want more of them all right let's let's try it out let's play some garen draven we're gonna go play over in ranked we're gonna go uh play five games over in ranked yeah we yep we played team of wayfinder on monday I'll see if I can get a link. Here it is. Thanks. There's a link to the YouTube channel and there's a link to that specific video. All right, what do we got? Karma Lux. You don't see a ton of Karma Lux these days. Karma Lux. Um, kind of makes me want some car caramel ice cream. Um, this could be a could be a difficult matchup. We'll see. Yeah, I could see us like really struggling against unyielding spirit, for example, or a big radiant guardian that's difficult to deal with. We got our Garen sleeves, our Garen board, our new Silver Wing. This is kind of like the Noxus Silver Wing, right? Like it's this fits our deck fairly well. It's like the perfect Guardian. Let's go, Crepturian Glory Seeker. If their plan is Remembrance turn three, which is a common thing for these Lux decks, we can try to get five damage in. Start off with a nice high five. All right. Not yet. Back to back. Jax. Do y'all remember Jax? Did anybody play Jax? That was like a little bit before my time. Anybody grow up playing Jax when they were a kid? Like Cracker Jacks. Is Cracker Jacks named after the game Jacks? Did you get like you get like a you got like a toy in Cracker Jacks? <laughs> You're just thinking of Pogs today, yeah. Same kind of thing. Remember me. Um, 
Um, I don't really want to trade Chevalier for one of these things. So I will just simply attack. Just see what happens here, you know, just have like these things available. Um, wow, that actually doesn't work out for me, does it? Huh. Okay. A disgrace. We march as one, an unstoppable force. Okay, yeah, you're very young when it was barely still a popular thing. That's that's kind of how I was, right? Like it wasn't. I was like three oh, years younger, you. probably. It could have been a thing. No, I'm just gonna take six. Gentlemen, ladies, the I don't want to turn on Radiant Guardian. Yet. We'll turn on next turn. No, yeah, the single combat on the 3-2 previously just, yeah, that was not enough value. So, you know, we could have used it, but it just wasn't, wasn't worth it. Their two champions are both are both very good. And so I like saving single combat and concerted strike for their champions. Uh, this would be me trading three cards from for you know for two basically, because you know I played the two, so like so it's a good trade. I could I could go single combat, kill the Bright Steel Protector, and then that stays alive. I don't know, but maybe I need that single combat for Lux. Okay, cool, we got another one. I'm gonna say for like Lux and uh, Karma and stuff like that. No, I'm in my. I'm old. I'm in my mid 30s. Uh. So, Concerted Strike would be perfect here, right? We could have the 3 1 and then the 5 5 strike. We could kill Lux with Concerted Strike. The problem is they can. They still have 4 mana. They can play stuff, they can play, I don't know, deny, whatever. Whatever they want to play. We'll play the War Chefs. Alright, don't tap out, let's see. Next turn we're at 8, 11 mana? I probably need 11 mana. Alright, Silverwing Vanguard, I won't play you. We're just gonna pass. Great against Unyielding Spirit. Tiburaz! Brand new Twitch Prime sub. Thank 
you. Thank you, Tiburaz. Strike that with this and that. Please don't have deny. Hopefully this works. Yeah. It worked. That's our fourth sub of the day. Very awesome. Chevalier's been sweet. We created that other Silverwing, the Silverwing Vanguard. Good job, Silverwing. Created that Silverwing Vanguard that just did a lot of work. We've also now Where there is life, made there is two Swiftwing Lances. Uh, Judgment. Judgment would hurt. Lies within. These woods belong to us. They have double because it'd be double judgment. We need more fight spells. Garen board music, very loud, very epic. Support. Do y'all think I I was definitely considering playing Garen over one of the warships? History will judge you. It's definitely considering that. Do y'all think I was supposed to do that? So many units, all we need, we just need spells. This game's not over. Don't count out karma. Yeah, 
this game's not over. Look within. I'm not gonna win this turn. The game's just not over. Let's see. Oh. Cool. I like seeing that. Chevalier has hit for us so many times. All we need to draw from our deck are spells, but we just keep drawing units. Yes, the we have cards that are better than War Chefs in hand, but is it worth? <clears throat> the question isn't, are these cards better than War Chefs? It's just, is it worth? obliterating a card and going down card advantage to put those things in play. I don't know. I kind of like having all these cards, but maybe... maybe I shouldn't have all of these cards. No. You cannot change the... change the art on your deck list in the deck screen yet. That'll change any patch now, but they said that that will change this year. It's just not been the case yet. Surprising that's all they did. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. Yeah, I agree that the, the client should have a music preview with the boards, like how it like whenever you go to purchase a board, there should be a click on it and preview the music that the board has. It just says it has its own music. Well, what is that music? a spell. Yeah, we got a 5-0 earlier. That was awesome.
but I just wish we could go like 12 deep. <laughs> we can't go 12 deep though. Wish we could. gonna create more this is just gonna create three more units for us in hand Many past lives stop doing that I'm just you know basically what what we're doing is we're just really hoping that Garen levels up and we get to attack again next turn that's the biggest uh, that's the biggest hope Break their ranks. <laughs> that is exactly what we're trying to do, trying to break the ranks. A gift from so they're going to draw more spells. I don't think they have room for another one, do they? Oh, they only draw the one. We must not relent. What form will the waters take? Yeah, get rid of that concussive palm. All right, well, we should be able to attack. You know, go straight to attacks with the help of Garen. I can either go Tracker plus Draven or Glory Seeker plus Glory Seeker. Just go with the two Glory Seekers. Or I could go Glory Seeker plus Legion Drummer. I need just a moment. I guess the good part about having Draven in play is that if we would draw another Draven, then we'd have the Whirling Death. Doing that to di discard a card to get them down to nine so they don't. Um, so they have the ability to. Stay resolute. Stay resolute, yes. So the ability to draw their card. Yuck. Do we have spells in this deck? <laughs> Alright, we got the attack token again. Karma versus Sparta. <laughs> Karma's been Karma's been doing it, so they should be out or so they're out of concussive palms. They've played what two concerted strikes? Maybe three? Definitely at least two. I guess they generate free card, you know, they generate just spells with karma, so you never know what they could generate. It's probably better for me to, they have four mana, it's probably better for me to just play new things out, just play another thing out.
All right, yay. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I should use the back-to-back -back on something else earlier. Then the Chevalier. Maybe need to. Uh, I made the Garen. In, I turned the Garen into a seven-seven. Maybe I should have turned. You know the. Our smaller thing, our Legion Drummer, into plus two, plus two. That could have helped as well. Demacia. Think attacks better? I don't know. They only have the four mana. We could. We could do some things before attack. Because they're like they're going to be playing a spell anyway, right? Like they're not playing another unit. And if they do play another unit, then they don't have the, you know like then we'll be fine. Because we'll because you know they still won't be wide enough. I do like single combat. But we need more. Now we need units. Uh, dang, getting really punished for keeping the single combat. <laughs> there we go. Good. There's an unstoppable force. Hey, Temple Dog. My shield is yours. Strength in grace, beauty. So I could have used the single combat. I think, right? No, I only had one mana. Never mind, I couldn't. Or no, because I played the tracker. Let's see. Protect and strike. Remember why we not to you. But it just single combat's more valuable than taking out like one of these little things. Oh no. I didn't play around that at all. Oh, that's rough. I definitely could have played around it a little bit at least. I could have had my the Chevalier challenge. The Butcher. Ouch. Let's get to it. That was the card they stole with the Yordle Grifter also. Yuck. No closer. We fight for those who cannot. Hmm. If I play this, I only have four mana. The party has arrived. The wicked must fall. Hey, Agent Iowa, thanks for the big time cheers. Played your Bannerman Brom deck in the new patch and peeled off 12 wins in a row. That deserves some hype right there. Most fun you've had on the ladder. That is awesome. So Brom is still good after the patch. I take it. What are you waiting for? Good to hear. Cool, it still works great. Awesome. I was wondering how Braum would be in that deck with... Um, with the zero power. So very... Very not sure what I was going to do. There's nothing really I want to discard it with. Um... Close your eyes. Away. 
Nothing I really wanted to discard with uh, Spinning Axe. How this works. So we'll see what they do. They they just went the smooth soloist. We'll see if they have a whole bunch of things that they can unload. Um, you know, with everything costing two less mana. This is kind of scary. I keep step with the heartbeat of Nazis. Fortune favors the bold. That's yeah, kind of scary. I don't really know why I do the quick attack over there. Doesn't really matter. I'm gonna, I mean, I'm gonna be trying this judgment. I don't expect them to have anything to break this up. If so, like I, I really, I really didn't set myself up well at all. If they did have something for that. both my cards to not let them because that can challenge and kill my Garen and I don't want that to kill my Garen so I'm basically going to be getting rid of all of this just to keep Garen alive yeah, we're cooking. I do not want Garen dying yeah I did there's no reason to support Narwhal I know um, I was just going to be doing the judgment I didn't make a good attack I'm not really here to defend that attack. Guns blazing. With me. Good Genevieve Elmhart. You've got dangerous eyes. I like that. Not just the eyes, you know. All right, that should be game. There's 11. All right. 2 and 0. That one looked a little bad there when they went, you know, Genevieve, like in the same turn, they played Genevieve Elmhart, Genevieve Elmhart. 
and Citrus Courier, right? They played all three of those in the same turn. Two Genevieve Elmhearts and a Citrus Courier. So that looked that started to look a little sketchy. And didn't they also play the they also played the the seven seven that turn, didn't they? Or the six six that turned into the seven seven. Yeah, so they played yeah. They played a a, a six six and then Genevieve Elmhart, then Genevieve Elmhart, then Citrus Courier. Some crazy stuff because of Smooth Soloist. Genevieve is so good. That is like, that's an honorary champion. That is an honorary champion right there. Uh, I like that one two. I'll just give this a try. No three right now, but I like the Blade Keeper growing, growing like a War Chef's or something. And then obviously Garen is good. That's the reason why we got some Garen sleeves. Garen board. Garen doing work. Be a great curve. All we gotta do is draw Laurent Protégé. Smell that? A fight Laurent Protégé. Off the top. Protégé. Close. Close. Can't be too mad at drawing a champion, I suppose. You name it, I'll nick it. Hmm. Move with purpose. Turning. Turning the tracker into a four-three doesn't really match up well against three twos. So we're gonna just block here and try to turn this thing into a 4-5. Um, so normally I wouldn't use single combat and I would just let this happen. It does stop at one trigger on an Ezreal. I think, I think it's better to just save uh, single combat for Garen. Or Demacia. Hey, Flosef. Um. Hmm. I mean, I want to. I want to help the Garen level up, right? Like, I want the single combat to level up the Garen. Let's do it on the next Garen. Taking seven. That's a lot. We got some healthy war chefs over here. They're they're eating good. Got a good lean diet. My strength is yours. For our war chefs. I'll do what must be done. That's quite unfortunate.
That is something that I need to worry about, I suppose, Yone. Don't blink, or you'll miss me. I'm not gonna miss you. Doesn't matter if I blink or not. I'm just not gonna miss you. One level up for Garen. I thought you'd never ask. I've had. I don't miss. Thanks, keep that so going, I've had. Fifteen awesome months. You are amazing. Thank you so much. That gets our sub goal. Y'all know what that means. We're going to have some bonus stream tonight. We're going to have some bonus room, Terra. Hitting that sub goal. No way. So after Spooky Sejuani. Bonus stream. Unstoppable force. Okay, you can attack first, and then you can pump up you. You can pump up. No, actually, you pump up you. Wait, no, we don't want to do that. Okay, you pump up you. You give you quick attack, and you pump you up for that. Okay. No one goes hungry. Eat up, friend. Don't be calling no enforcers. You cannot win. So two Ezreals are dead. They got one Ezreal left. Presumably, maybe they're only playing two. You cannot stall judgment. You cannot stop Demacia. Down to four. Saving concerted strike for karma. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. Ah, the whole family is here. He is a distant and not for Yone. There we go, another win for Demacia. Chaos. 10 awesome months. Thank you so much, Chaos. Welcome back. Heck, we're getting towards another stream goal that we'll do some bonus. If we hit the next stream goal, we'll do some bonus stream the next stream also. Let's get, we'll just keep adding up. Um, yeah, I wasn't, I'm somebody who's always been down on Karma Ezreal. I, I'm not somebody who's that impressed with that deck. And yeah, after the nerf, it just seems worse also. Mossy is underrated. Uh, I should probably keep one Concerted Strike. I don't know. Concerted Strike's a good removal spell, but it also costs five mana. I'm going to just try to curve out. We're just going to mulligan it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, man, we have Draven in our deck? Y'all, do y'all remember we have Draven in our deck? That card's good. I wish we had the attack on turn two. Ah, uh, they have the attack turn two. Lucky. 
Please don't have Bright Steel Protector. Please do not have Protector. No Protector. No Protector. Play Lucian. Now. Lucky. Free kill. It's that's why it's so good to have the attack token on turn two with this combo. Just get a free card. Press on. All right. So do I go Draven or do I go uh, Tracker Plus? One of these. Probably supposed to go Tracker Plus. One of those. Mm -hmm. Draven's pretty sweet. Start piling up those uh, spinning axes. Time for the main event. Yeah, we would be looking great if we were attacking turn two. For the attack turn two. Now they're looking great. I need more runs. Axes coming right up. Hmm. Ready. There was a huge nerf to Karma as Karma as. Will of Irony went down to 5 mana. It's a big nerf. To Karma as. Also, Karma as wasn't even good before that. And also Shadow Assassin. Which I think they played Shadow Assassin. That also got nerfed. Slow down, will you? Theoretically, Karma as would be good against mid-range decks. Theoretically, but doesn't really match up like that. Um, let's see, let's see. You hoping they'll die of boredom? I don't know, maybe. I'm just I'm just going to take 6. So let's just make 5-5 five, five Draven. Yeah, and then take 6. Here we go. Like, Garen's great, but I could also play Tracker and Protector and Warshafts. That sounds pretty great. It's a tough call. But getting Garen to level up as fast as possible is probably the most desirable outcome out of any outcome. Obviously, the problem is, like, removal spells. New recruit reporting in. You know, just like a, a repost. Hope no repost. Back when you're yapping. I'm, I'm ready. Hey, 
Cool. Now we're best. Safeguard our citizens. Well, it was good news for a little bit. Alright, we need to go wide. I'll defend these forests to the end. Gosh, these things are all so big. Genevieve is so good. I can't imagine auto banning auto banning uh, karma as I would I would I would auto ban frostbite midrange I would love to play against karma as with anything but diff different people are different Possible I'm not supposed to play stuff out and then I'm just supposed to go straight to attacks. But the Badger Bear eats my War Chefs. I am scared of another Bannerman. Basically, that's what I'm saying. That I'm scared of another Bannerman. I'm glad not. Another bannerman, at least not yet. I'll cut them apart. You're mine. Run them through. Hard to bear. Feel the sizzle. I, I should do this. Break their ranks. And they can't kill my war shafts. No, the deck codes don't carry long emotes and boards and stuff like that, no. They just use like whatever your last whatever the last deck you played. I think that's what it uses for your emotes and boards and things like that, I think. I'm one of the good guys, but not I think it just uses that info. Smell that? A bite to cook it. Hey potato, welcome back. Yeah, got the five win. We we played mostly in normal last game last time with Jinx. Head to the base. This attack. Let's see. So basically the problem alright, so Scout blocks here and then the two three blocks my Garen. Yeah, tough tough should help out. Right, because then tough, Garen only takes one, and Garen's a six-five, and then they can't, then they can't attack. So yeah, we should be okay. Just as no one goes hungry. With tough. Oh no! If they just don't block. Oh, that's actually that's a lot worse for me. If they just don't block. 
Oh no, that was smart. Oh gosh, that was smart. The knot lock. No, we're still fine. We're still fine. Everything's good. Don't get in my way. No. Oh, what a bad attack. Yes, they blew it. It's very obvious. You just, just, they just pop up the Lucian and I'm dead. Let's go. Genevieve. No, I mean, they, they could have just easily won there if they were just bumped, bumped with the Lucian. Looking for trouble. It found you. Well, they're drawing their champions. I'm drawing my champion, too. Genevieve Elmhart. That's a champion if I've ever seen one. I'll let them support block. <laughs> Let's go, Garen. Not bad. Oh, no! No! No, come on! Saboteur? How are we gonna lose this? We're gonna lose this. You picked the losing side. No, there goes the 5 0 dream. Is that the only card that my opponent can draw to win? I think so. I mean, they could they could just have Mega Rain, right? Like maybe they have Mega Rain in their deck. I don't know. Um, but yeah, they they drew the three drop, get the one drop, and the one drop is like the only one drop. I mean, I guess it's not the only one. They could they could have gotten an elusive one drop. Ah. <sighs> I don't no, I don't think we should have blocked the scout bear with the Draven. Maybe I should have blocked it with the two three. Okay. Um, what are we playing against? Sejuani Misfortune. I kind of think this Rangers resolve could be a big blowout like it was against us the previous game. Oh, pup. You want to jump? You want to join us, pup? Oh! a salesperson at the door. Uh, yeah. Looks like a reasonable trade. 
I don't get the Ranger's Resolve value. But I think that's still worth it. Trading one drop for two drop. Yeah, them stealing our Rangers was all last time. Brutal. Um. Who does not know the name Laurent? Let's, I guess we just let this happen. And trading three drop for two drop. We're trading up mana each time. You know, we basically spent the same amount. They have a 1 1 left and I have a 2 4. Time for the main Ooh, what's up, Draden? Give me that. Yes, Agent Iowa, I did see your donation deck just a little bit ago. I'll write that down. If I can find my pen. I dropped my pen a little bit ago. Success. Now I can't find it. You around here. Stop. Stop with that. We fight for those who cannot. Make my stuff vulnerable. So it's for a Fiora Lux deck. My camera is really far off. Why is my the camera so far off? No place for the weak. Did that refresh? Not really. Always forward. Now we're cooking. <laughs> Maybe it's not so bad. I can't figure out how to how to refresh it. Did that work? There. Maybe that worked. Okay. Gonna keep challenging over there? What do you think? Nope. Challenging. Yeah, the Whirling Death is very enticing. Going Whirling Death to level up. I mean, so I can either go Chevalier with um, with Bright Steel Protector, making it, you know, giving it barrier and have Chevalier kill Misfortune. Like that's a, you know, that's a great line. Or we can just attack, have go Garen Whirling Death. You hoping they'll die of boredom? And level up Garen. Oh, uh, that's really enticing too. What do we do? They're both so great. Your form is good. That I don't know. Good. Thank you. I guess I'll go this route. Pain is nothing. Yeah, Garen Whirling Death looking a little better right now. Than it did just a second ago. Something good like Ranger's Resolve or something. Harry, 
You are toast. Hardly fair. Hardly fair. Not my first gun fight. Take the rest. Ooh, got some fighting ya. Not my first gun fight. Yeah, I should have challenged Miss Fortune. I honestly just, I was just thinking about, like, I was just thinking about my place here, and I just forgot that, that the Chevalier was challenge her, and yeah, I should have challenged Miss Fortune. See them using like a Fury of the North on the Sejuani, which I kind of want them to do. I was gonna say the, the reason why I'd want them to do that was, um, yeah. Then we then we use Whirling Death and kill it, and then they wouldn't be able to play the Shark. Looks like they're just gonna play the Shark. So hope Garen doesn't die to the Shark. Why, did, why should I drag said Wani to the right? Like that that matters against me and against Ionia decks. Whatever. I don't I don't see any reason why that would matter in that matchup. That matters against the lifesteal barrier. With Garen level up? Does it Does that does that matter with Garen level up? With the judgment? I think I've seen that before, haven't I? Oh, it would hit for six with the okay. Well that's that's something to know if you're gonna play this deck. Okay, so that's why that matters. So what we're talking about here is when you have judgment that that's striking all the battling enemies, it'll strike from left to right. And so once it once Garen has struck twice, Garen levels up mid judgment. And so then the rest of whatever Garen is striking, uh, they take six instead of five. So I could have killed Sejuani with that if I pull Sejuani to the end. It's a good call. I forgot about that. And so, yeah, that's something that we could have done with that judgment. Um, so that's something good to know. That's, you know, basically if you just play a Garen deck at all, you know, it doesn't have to be this deck, but any Garen deck because Garen creates the judgment with the champion spell. That's something good to know with Garen. Um, yeah, this was a good deck. Yeah, we went 4-1 over in Masters and super close to that 5-0, right? Like that game that we lost, that, that game four, what a crazy game. I didn't think that we were losing that at all, but, you know, we just barely lost it one little life. That's all we needed. Um, you know, that was, that was a crazy, crazy game. So yeah, ho hopefully you learned something there with the Garen Judgment. That was, I've, I learned that a while ago because we played against that and, and my opponent did that and I was mad. But uh, yeah, I forgot about that. Chevalier was awesome. Um, I think that the worst card in this deck is probably the Blade Keepers, personally. But they weren't necessarily bad. They're just probably the worst card in the deck. I would be, I kind of would think that maybe just another Bright Steel Protector and another Glory Seeker, like maybe just go three and three with those would probably be better than blade keepers i think those those would probably be better cards to be honest um but yeah the uh oh i'm glad we also never drew might and i'm very glad that we never drew might i don't think might's a good card i i am i am down on might i'm i think that we did well because we didn't ever have might i feel i'm actually really glad we never drew might i can't believe i forgot this is a three of man we never had it a single time i'm really glad about that I would, I would, again, instead of Might, I would rather have another single combat. I'd rather have Riposte. I would rather have back-to-back. -back. I'd rather have Concerted Strike. I'd rather have the Barrier card. Um, I'd rather have Culling Strike. I'd rather, I'd rather have basically any other spell. Um, I'd rather have Prismatic Barrier. I think that Awesome Finisher is very, very overrated. I don't think that, I think that, as you saw, like, with all those games, don't need it. I mean, it's having a card in your deck that that its sole purpose is you are already winning and once you're already winning it can do the last points of damage to have you win 
when if you're already winning and you and you have a spell like that spell like you're probably just going to win anyway like i don't think that this is useful does that make sense like it's it's like if if you're already winning you don't need this as a finisher because you just have some other you know like if it's just anything else like you're probably already going to be winning and you'll you'll be fine um there's not like games that you may lose that might helps you win like right like that doesn't happen um so i i would i forgot that this was in our deck because we never drew it and i and i'm really glad uh i would uh like this is just me like cordex this is a cordex deck and they said they were they're very happy to have it i i wouldn't play it at all i would play get another repost in here and um let's see probably uh, the single combats and the concerted strikes were awesome like getting rid of my opponent's units i'd probably just want more of those get that extra repost and then one more single combat one more concerted strike both of those cards were incredible for us so yeah i would i would go with that i would just max out on on all those get a second repost um let's see and then as we were talking about maybe instead of blade keeper maybe more um more of the two mana cards these two mana cards are really good glory seeker and bright steel protector and they work great together like bright steel protector just kind of works really well with everything right like bright steel protector is just great with all these challengers um with chevalier or protege or glory seeker um you know it's obviously great with fleet feather tracker as well i was really happy with the rangers resolve that card looked really good um that's a card that i don't usually have in my demacia decks but this really helped us win a couple of games this this card looked great um so that's that was a, a good real good showing for rangers resolve but there we go there's garen and and of course more more single combats and more concerted strikes are just more ways for garen to strike more way for chevalier to strike uh those are pretty awesome all right that's it here for Garen Draven. Those of y'all watching on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And of course, feel free to leave those comments as well. Hopefully y'all uh, learned some stuff there with the judgment. Hopefully y'all uh, kind of saw how Garen's really underrated. It was uh, being awesome for us. And just these Demacia cards in general. Single or Legion Drummer was great. That card was, was really great for us. Pretty sweet little deck here. All right, but anyway... Thank you so much for watching. It's some Garen Draven. I really appreciate it. Y'all are awesome. Uh, take care. Have a good one. I'll see you for the next video.